This is video number four, Sketchbook Pro, how to back up your work, and this also includes instruction on how to bring your work back from Google Drive just in case your work was deleted. So the first thing you're going to need to do is go to Google Drive, sorry, to Sketchbook Pro, and you need to go to the gallery in one of two different ways. You can click on gallery here from the menu, or you can pinch, that'll bring you here. Then down in the lower right hand corner there's a little menu button. You click on that and down here if you scroll down you'll see export PSD among other things. You can rotate your image here or make a duplicate of it. Uh, so you click export PSD and then you will choose save to drive. You will already be logged in and you can see here that you're already logged in. Now here you'll notice it's in blue. So here's an option for you to press and hold that because it gives you some crazy long title and give this some meaningful title like t-shirt plan one. Notice the end is .psd. You can't change that. If you change that this file will no longer work. Then you can see over here it says folder my drive. If you want to change the location you can create a subfolder by clicking the plus up there and giving it a name. So I'm just going to save it into my drive, and there we go. That is now done. Very, very simple. So let's see. I'm back in Sketchbook Pro. Let's say somebody accidentally deleted that work. So that work is now gone. The question is, how do I get it back? Most people will go to Google Drive and try and open it from Google Drive. That's not going to work. Instead, you go back to the same place where you exported it, but instead of clicking this menu here, you click the plus and click New from Image and then you'll click drive and now your drive will show up and there's your file t-shirt plan number one dot psd you'll select that and that file is now opened and notice all of the layers are there that's what a psd file is and that basically is an overview of how to back up your work and how to re-import it